I think you must by now be getting a sense of the dynamics of turns and curved lines and changes of rain. This particular class is about the line of it, the line of these things. I want your mind to be upon the sighting of the lines and I want to emphasize the relationship between curved lines and the straight lines that follow them. I want this to be automatic in you that you way in advance mark the turns and curved lines on the ground in the sand with your eye like this. You see the entry, you see the apex, and you see the exit. Entry, top, exit. These simple figures cannot be too correctly executed. Vince Lombardi talked seven hours about a single play and we can and we might do that in a future course on turns, curved lines, and changes of rain. But right now, I want us to get on with it and look at straight lines so we can ride the co-action of the two types of lines, like breathing in and breathing out. Exhale and inhale, they co-act. They belong together, but they're separate functions. Same with curved lines and straight lines. A horse who uses his turns and curved lines properly, he's ready to go upon entry into the straight line. He sees his new line in advance. He's already engaged uphill upon arrival. He's prepared. And because of this schooled second nature, he knows what he should do on the new line. This is what we want. Coming through his turn, can you see Kit see his next straight line? The interaction of the curved lines with the straight line, it's like breathing. This is riding. There's no better feeling than the horses who understand and do this themselves, who know these. This is horse training. This is riding. Horses who see the lines themselves, the same lines that we see.